Hello, welcome to your weekly oracle card reading from the 17th to the 23rd of April. I would like to draw a card to see what the energy will be like for all of us, which is inclusive of all of the 12 signs. I will draw one card for the weekdays and another card for the weekend while taking a look at the shadow card as well. I'm using Doreen Virtue's Archangel Power Tarot Cards deck, and even though there are 78 cards in this deck that follow the standard tarot organization, I really do consider these as uh, oracle cards because they have messages written on the bottom of all of them. So let's see what the energy is for the week ahead. 17 to the 23rd of April. week, the weekend, and the shadow card. All right. So this week looks like things are getting in order. There is some sort of energy that is being expressed here of everything being in divine order and in divine timing in order to support your success for the best results. I always see this as being a card of success and moving forward and you're in the second stages of your current goals. The card says, congratulations, you've done a wonderful job. Time to move on to the next project, awards, scholarships, or promotions. So there could be some sort of aspect of you feeling recognized uh, for your work and for your creative talents and efforts. The Epiphanies card is usually the Hermit card. In the major arcana. The hermit is this sort of Virgo energy. It can be an energy of being sort of behind the scenes. Okay, the hermit is about going within for one, two, going sort of away from the crowd for some sort of contemplation and introspection. And this is where these ideas can grow and um, foster new ideas. Okay, so we do need some time to sort of rest and rejuvenate and sort of reflect in order to sort of see where we want to place our energies next for, again, the best results for our creative projects that will bring success. So this card says, joy through spiritual growth, being a light to others, and answers that come through meditation. This week is going to be very active and very social, and then the weekend, a lot of us are going to want to uh, retreat and sort of do our own thing and listen to our wise selves, okay? The shadow card is the nine of Michael, which is the nine of swords, and I always say this is a card of like excessive worry. And sometimes in life, we have this bigger picture of where we want to go but we're not exactly sure of how we're going to get there or how everything is going to work out. And in order for us to really realize our goals, we have to have a certain um, amount of surrender to how the process is going to unfold. We can keep this sort of vision in mind, but the details and everything of the way that it's going to work out sometimes is out of our control and should be out of our control because it's too much mental responsibility to figure out everything, okay? So we can have the vision, we can do the actions, and the rest to the way that it sort of unfolds is sort of how we interact with this higher power or God. So there's some sort of relinquishment of uh, mental stress and worry. 
This card says your worry is unnecessary. Focus your thoughts on the outcome you desire. Release feelings of regret, guilt, or worry to your angels. I do see that meditation here this weekend and sort of having that quiet respite place is going to be a place of healing. And that is a prime time to really meditate in order to not have this energy of worry and um, sort of looking at what could have been or what should I have done um, in the past, okay? Or even, you know, lack of clarity of where I'm going. So this is sort of the energy that we have is to um, reflect on the, the direction we want to move forward with our current projects sort of for the next stage and letting go of you know how the details are going to work out but still sort of having that you know end goal in mind so this is what i'm seeing for this uh, coming week i hope this video was helpful to you and you enjoyed watching this thank you for liking and sharing my videos and also for subscribing to my channel I will see you in the upcoming videos.